Hi, welcome to Unruly Guides. In this video, this is part of our D DIY or do-it-yourself ebook formatting kit, and we're going to show you how you can take your formatted and validated EPUB and turn it into a AZW or MOBI file with one simple step. The first thing you need to do is open up your file in SIGL. Now SIGL is a WYSIWYG, which is what you see, what you get, free program from um, Google. So what you do is do a quick search on Google for SIGIL, and I know I'm not saying it correctly, but that's okay, and open up or download the file or the program and open up your EPUB file. Now you can see that we're working with My Book EPUB. Now we created this with our do-it-yourself formatting tutorial to show you how to easily create an EPUB file. Now as you can see that we have a cover and a cover JPEG. Now in the Kindle, as we showed in the previous um, video, number 10, Kindle will show both these cover and the cover JPEG. So essentially you have two covers. Now if it doesn't bother you, that's fine. You can still just upload the EPUB directly to Kindle. But for a lot of people, they want to remove it. And it's a very, very simple process. You simply go to the cover, you right click, you go remove, you go OK. Yes, you want to remove it. And then you, what you want to do is you want to go File and Save As, not Save, but Save As. And you might want to do that first to make sure you don't mess up your original EPUB. But you go Save As, and what I like to do is just add a K after it. And you want to go to the file where you're going to be saving it. And ours is it was in the DIY Formatting Kit, My Book, My Book-K. You can see I have one. I'm just going to override it and go Save. And now you have one. Now you want to proof this to make sure it shows up. So I'm going to show you the differences. So what I have open here is Kindle Previewer. And you can get a Kindle Previewer for the Mac or PC easily from Amazon. Just do Kindle Preview for Mac, Kindle Preview for PC, do a search, and it will show you the page where you can download it. Now what I'm going to do first is I'm going to show you what the EPUB looked like before we corrected it. Now this is the folder where we just saved the file. Now if we drag over Previewer, the, the oh, not the doc, I'm sorry, the original EPUB, you can see that we'll open to Chapter 1, and that's what we set it as our start page in the DIY formatting kit. You can see here that it also supplies the NCX file, which is the five-way controller in the Kindle, where you can jump from chapter to chapter. We have a table of contents, and now we, have, we look at the cover. Now the cover looks great, but if you click to the next page, you have two of them. And that's where the issue was. So if you go back and you do a simple preview of the same file, but the one we just made, and it still has the NCX file, the table of contents, and the cover. Now you can see it has the cover. If you click, it goes straight to the copyright page. So it eliminates that double cover look. So you can see that you can easily create one file, which is an EPUB, and use for all formats. And it's actually two files, but this is such an easy fix for the Kindle that it's really just one format. So I want to thank you for stopping by, and if you have any more questions, please visit unreallyguides.com or send me an email. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for listening.